gotta tell you something I could do. I'm gonna put these clothes up. So, Thanksgiving has now begun in Hugh's house. Oh, I got my camera view on. So I have no idea what time it is. No idea what time it is. I also feel like I should have a necklace on, but I don't have a necklace. All right, I can place my outfit. Here we are. This necklace I got from my sister, I think. I think my sister bought this for me for my birthday this year. I have a similar one like this. I don't know where it is. That a friend of mine bought for me two years ago. Or three years ago. Some years ago for my birthday. Earrings is Christmas from last year. Obviously my wedding ring. You see all this drip. I don't even know if I'm using that word correctly. But uh, yeah. Let's go ahead and get this. Um, I'm going to do some laundry. Uh, like I said, Chris is going to be doing most of the cooking. I hate, I, I have anxiety about cooking on Thanksgiving. Still working through that myself. Um, asking the Lord to deliver me from it. He hasn't done it yet. Um, so, um, it smells so good in here. Hubby has just finished cooking. We almost finna eat. Yeah. Ah. I figured we would be eating by three o'clock. So I'm so glad I didn't eat when I got up. I didn't get up to 12, 35. Mind your business. One. Um, but, um, I just finished recording a video. I'm so excited. It's going to be this whole new series that I'm covering about family planning and what me and my husband are doing to plan to expand our family if um that's gonna be posted after this hopefully i can have this up on black friday pray no i'm gonna have this up on black friday um or maybe tonight either way and then that video will come later on sometime so um i remember to come back hopefully i remember to come back to link it in down or somewhere maybe probably not i'm not gonna remember that but um yeah i'm gonna put this clothes up so I can get ready to eat because your girl is starving, okay? Starving. So yeah. I filmed it while putting my while folding my clothes. So we're gonna fit to put them up. Mm hmm I got rice here. Look at this mac and cheese. Look at this cabbage. Beautiful. And this chicken baby. Baby, this chicken. Oh. Only thing that's left. It's 
Oh, look. Look at all of it. <gasps> it looks so good. Come here, Chef. <laughs> Chef Ligardi. <laughs> really? <laughs> you did good. You did good. Why are you calling me Nigga RD? Chef Nigga RD. I saw, I got a clip of that too. Y'all wish y'all could smell it in here. Yeah. Yeah. If you could smell it in her, okay? Dang it. Okay, I gotta show you the video again. This is my outfit, mama. All of it. So we're gonna try try this macaroni and cheese. Apparently he put his foot in this. I I tried to I put a little bit more seasoning in it this time around. Christopher! You like it? Christopher! <laughs> This tastes like grandma mac and cheese. Stop it. Yes, it does. I'm on here looking for my daddy. Uh, birthday present. What? I'm recording. My dad. He turns 65 next Friday. My daddy get to retire, and I'm so excited. I mean, I, when I go home, I don't have to go by his job to go see him because he only off on Sundays. So, and he likes the Washington football team. That's the foolishness. Oh, look at this shirt. This shirt says Cowboys, Eagles, football team, Giants. Oh, Lord. <laughs> that looks so weird. Cowboys, Eagles, Giants are all football teams. No, that's not what it's saying. All right, Josh, I'm I'm feeling a little. I'm, the itis is hitting me, and I need to charge my phone. So, what did I come out here for? Jesus Christ! If I walk back, you said to walk through a door. You might not remember. Oh, worked. Um. I'm gonna go and probably take a nap because I'm tired. And I learned last night that that um, in the past we used to take segmented, we used to sleep in segments like three to four hours, four to five hours at a time throughout the day until Tom Ford. Not Tom Ford. Henry Ford. Girl, I'm... <sighs> I am sleeping. And I need to really focus on trying to find this gift for my daddy. And my phone is dying. So, I'm going to put my phone on the charger. And, ooh. It's off pudding. I'm going to put my phone on the charger and find this present. And go to bed. Yeah. So I see you on the bed. So I said I was going to sleep, but I forgot I rented um Carmen Hip the Carmen a hip hop bro on um Amazon Prime. And so that's what I'm gonna watch. And then I'm gonna go to sleep. <laughs>
So I take it you want to be an actress. Me is none of your business. Okay, so I did not end up taking my nap. I ended up finished watching that trash movie. I don't know why I love that movie so much. But if you can see behind me, ooh, I am getting ready, <coughs> excuse me, to um, put my tree up with my beautiful sister-in-law. For context but she's just my sister to me <clears throat> I was eating chips and I feel like I went down the wrong tube and now it's still feel like it's on down the wrong tube Whew, that was dark my bad but I'm going to get my ornaments and lights and stuff because <clears throat> Christmas is going up see my shirt although y'all seen the shirt multiple times I don't, it's hard, I love Christmas. It's hard for me to, to just leave this stuff for Christmas. But anyways, this is my Christmas bin. My shirt says, my sweater says Merry, Merry, Merry. Because Thanksgiving is over. It is now time for Christmas. <laughs> I'm supposed to FaceTime her. And oops, we're going to put our trees up together. We are supposed to be, she was supposed to spend, be here. <clears throat> Technically, I was supposed to, we were supposed to be at my mother-in-law's house right now and um, spending Thanksgiving with them. Tomorrow, going to see my family. And then, on our way back to Florida, home, with my sister, because she was going to come here and spend her Christmas break off here before she has to go back to college um, next month. No, January, which I find out that they don't even go back to the end of January. She got like a two... She literally has two months off from school, which is crazy. <sighs> so it didn't work out that way. We're not going, we're not traveling right now because of COVID. Cases have gotten much worse. Obviously we don't want to be part of the um, spread, especially since we don't need to go up there. Um, both of us are very capable of cooking and buying gifts for each other like it's <clears throat> there's literally there's not a reason for us to go up there um right now unfortunately even though i'd really like for us to go spend holidays with our families especially since this this christmas is a little special since my dad's birthday is next week and he is turning the big six five so this is also he ha probably has like a couple more days left at his job and he is retiring y'all and i'm so excited because over the years since living in florida or living whenever since leaving my mom's house and you know going back to visit my dad and stuff like that i would only be able to go by his job and like see him on a 15 minute lunch break or something like that which is frustrating you know because he works he he works a lot he only has sunday off and i'm always traveling back home on sunday to get back to florida <clears throat> so now that he's retiring that means that I can go and visit him whenever I want to spend more time with him stay over go out to lunch and stuff like that he can come here to visit me um obviously with COVID it's not working out that way which is frustrating because we've been waiting we can count we literally have been counting down this day since last year last year his birthday Last year, his birthday, when he turned 64, I set a calendar date and we started counting down the days. And so every time we talk on the phone, it's usually once a week or once every other week. <clears throat> um, we'd both say, oh, you got six months left. You got seven months left. You got five months left. Oh, daddy, you got 30 days left. We under 100 days. We under 60 days. We got a month left. Now we literally have a week left to his birthday. His birthday is a week from today. And... Or a week from tomorrow. Whatever. But, um. Wait, is it about the next week? Child, I don't know. Um. So. I'm a little sad. I'm really sad that I won't be able to get to go down there. I was looking forward to. I wouldn't have saw him next week. Because another thing that happened is. my Me, Chris, and my sister. We were supposed to go to Am Amber. Her name is Amber Lord. We were going to go to Boston 
next week for four days. We're going to fly to Boston for a little mini, mini vacation. Check out some, um, visit some extended family up there. Um, my sister's actually going to grad school and a couple of schools that she's thinking about attending is in Boston, in the Boston area. <sighs> she had to cancel that trip, which I was really looking forward to because none of us have ever been to Boston. Um, cancel our planes, tickets, and everything, which is frustrating. But, and then the following week, I and my sister were going to be traveling back to South Carolina because my niece, two of my nieces, one of them is turning two, the other one is turning four. Their birthdays are two days apart. And my girlfriends, <laughs> so my girlfriends were, we were having a, like a Christmas get together, Christmas lunching type deal. Um, so I was trying to work out a way to, to attend that as well <sighs> and stay at my mother-in-law's house for like a week. And then me and her were going to drive back to South Carolina, I mean to Florida, and she was going to stay with us until whenever, sometime in February, in January. So Christmas, would have, we would have been together and we are not. So we have to improvise, like putting the trees up together on FaceTime. She's doing it in my mother-in-law's house. I'm doing it here. So this is not, obviously this is not the, this is not the Christmas or the holiday that any of us, any of us planned for, but we're making the best of what we can do, being thankful for what we have and just being real honest about our feelings. I honestly, honestly am blessed to be here, but this sucks, but it is what it is. So. I'm gonna go ahead and get these. This is my Christmas box. All my Christmas stuff in here. Y'all even got my mama's. I got my mama's um, Christmas skirt, which was another thing. <laughs> so all of my, all of my in-laws, they were gonna come here for Christmas, like they did last year. So that's not gonna happen either. All of it is just a mess. Like, I, but uh, let's just move on. Cause I don't, I, I'm gonna come back. I don't know how to process these emotions right now. And I'm making the best of the holiday that I do have. Thankful that I am here to see a holiday, despite my human emotions of just feeling disappointed of how this year has gone thus far. This being one of the, the, you know, the minor things that is upsetting about this year. Very, very minuscule. So, I'm going to close this blind. I keep looking at this blind. It's like partially, well, not the blind, the curtain is partially open. So, anyways, let me go ahead and get this Christmas box up. So, we can put this tree up. So, I'm supposed to call her. Oh, it's like at seven. Just like now. So I put this little tree up, missing stuff from it, but it is what it is. I'm going to fix it when I get to the store, probably Saturday. I'm not leaving the house tomorrow. So uh, y'all need to tell me what I need to do in these comments to fill out this tree. Anyways, I think I'm going to make some popcorn and watch a movie. Yeah, for the next hour and a half. Because I'm going to bed at 10. Yeah, girl, I got to work tomorrow. Yeah. Excuse me. Why I um, clean my car. I really love this angle. Y'all. I can't. Okay? I mean, it's just... So you can see my little Christmas in the back. You can see my little Christmas in the back. See my kitchen and all that. Like, from this angle, it looks like I got money and stuff. And, and I do. <laughs> I do. Very much rich. Okay. Very rich. Anyway, <laughs> I just finished editing the um, Thanksgiving vlog that I'm finna post. Probably in the next hour or so. And um, and I forgot to close. 
So I hope you all have a very thankful, you know what? I need to stop calling it Thanksgiving day. So I'm still doing my research to find the correct term for Thanksgiving. I saw some people calling it day of thanks. Some people are calling it day of giving. I saw some people are calling it, um, what's another term that I saw? Um, indigenous people day. So I am going to continue to do my research to figure out what I am going to call it. Most likely I'm going to label the video, title the video Thanksgiving, just for the analytics. Okay. But uh, whatever you call the day, however you celebrate yesterday, I hope it was wonderful. I hope it was everything that you needed it to be. And if yesterday was just a Thursday, I hope you had a great Thursday and an even better Friday. And the rest of 2020, keep holding out, y'all, because, ooh, ain't no telling what else can come to us, okay? Let's just stay prayed up, rest up, and ready, because that's all we can do. If you like this video, make sure you share it, like it, comment, let me know down in the comments. Tell me what to do about this tree. Y'all saw that I was asking those questions. Please let me do this tree. And um, I will continue to bless you with more content, okay? Make sure you subscribe um, to my channel because we're going to be doing Vlogmas. <laughs> Yes, and um, thank you for watching this long. I really appreciate you. Have a blessed rest of your day. It's a